It's finally here, Super Smash Bros. Ultimate. I'm so excited. And just one thing I want to share with you guys. Currently, when I play this, I'm so excited. I'm going to play with this for now, but I got my old GameCube controllers. And when they talked about um, how you can be able to, your GameCube comp controllers are going to be compatible to this game. Uh, lucky for me, I hold on to old game systems in the controllers. Uh, I have my old, one of my old GameCube controllers that I'm going to be using, but I couldn't find the adapter because uh, they didn't even have it. GameStop didn't even have it. So I'm going to have it probably by the 18, so I'll be able to connect and play a little bit better and have just better movement with the controls. I don't know how it's going to play uh, on this switch controller where you put you attach both the joy cons in like you're holding a real controller i'm going to see how that plays out um throughout the weekend and throughout the week and then um once i get that adapter i'm going to be using the gamecube controller so now i'm not going to play online right away i'm going to try to focus on unlocking all these different characters look and they have what inkling from splatoon i never even played splatoon before but they have so many different characters from the other game that they decided to add it's every single character from every all the super smash bros from way back in from the nintendo 64 days back where it all started for this series it's one of my favorite fighting games over street fighter tekken soul caliber or what have you mortal kombat and anything like that i'm going to always pick super smash bros over all those games and that's why i waited all year long to play this game once I once they revealed it at E3 for Nintendo's press conference. But before I unbox it, we're gonna sh I'm gonna show you guys the back here. It says everyone is here, and they're not playing. They're not joking right here. Everyone is here. Every Smash Bros. fighter returns, joined by all new challengers. So that's in Spanish. 70 fighters, 100 stages, 100 plus stages, new game modes, and more. And as you can see, I'm gonna try to get in, get closer so you guys can see. Hopefully the camera focuses. You can see all new adventure mode, and I'll read it to you guys. Rescue fighters and hundreds of characters in a massive single-player campaign. So, you can see some of the characters. Let me zoom out. See, all the originals at the top. Mario, Donkey Kong, Zelda, Samus, even just Zero Suit Samus. That's some either different... Uh, Changes here. All the original characters that started Yoshi, Kirby, Fox, Pikachu, and Ness. All the originals at the top. And then as they as as they went on from Super Smash Bros. Melee Peach was a uh, playable. All types of different characters. And they have Daisy here, but she's not even a real character. I don't think she's just probably part of the assist trophies and stuff. But I'm, I can't wait to try these all these out. I'm gonna try every character and then some of my favorites my all-time favorite is Sonic I'm a Sonic main. I love using it and most people probably won't think he's a very good character But way back on Super Smash Bros on the Wii I always used him as some of my favorites Yoshi Pokemon trainer was another favorite that I like and then from the new one as the new one came out I was rocking with uh, Mega Man and also Rob I think he's a unique character too. Well, I'm going to try out all the characters in the game. Those are just some of my top favorites that I use the most. And uh, even characters like Wario. I use a, a very odd character with different moves. So I think they're probably going to have different movesets. Obviously, in the Super Smash, the, Super, the final Smash moves are different now. And uh, characters like Sonic that I use the most as my main, I think his new Super Smash or his new final Smash is better than... Uh, last time so I'm gonna go ahead and unbox it so that's just that'll just be my plan I'm gonna try out every game mode that I can let me see if I can just get it get this to focus because it's out of focus I don't know there you go I'm just so excited to jump in and I'm still playing games like Pokemon Red Dead all types of different playthroughs so I'm not gonna just drop everything and just play Smash Brothers all the time, but I'm, it's it's Smash Week. It's 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 Super Smash Bros. Weekend. But I'm gonna be playing it all throughout the weekend, just with a mix of other games. So it's not just the same thing over and over. 
because now I'm playing two different Switch games and then just the game modes. I'm going to experience and see what they, what kind of game modes they have and then just unlock characters because it's probably going to take a lot of time just to unlock all these different characters. I know they announced DLC. I didn't get the Fighter Pass because I'm not in a hurry with that. And they added Joker to the game. Big deal. But I'm not even going to really probably be interested in getting that right away. I'll probably get it at a later date. And then I'm hearing rumors about a Persona DLC that they're also announcing for the game. All these different characters that they're branching out with. Joker from the DC Universe and now from the Jer one of the best JRPGs out there, arguably, from the Persona series. Pretty crazy. So now I'm going to show you guys the inside here. So you got all the little original characters. There it is. So you guys can see him. And then even on his right side. And then the game itself. Ready to fight. So that's it. For a little unboxing. Pretty cool case. So this is going to be dope. Can't even close it. There it go. So I'm ready. I'm so excited for Super Smash Bros. Ultimate. And uh, that's just going to be my plan. So I'm going to play through all the game modes. My main focus is going to be trying to unlock all the characters. I'm probably not going to show every character that I unlock. I'll just probably bring you guys up to speed of all the different characters that I end up going through so I'm just gonna probably do that might practice a little bit with some of the characters see how they play see the differences and the changes with some of the characters that I really love to use from the old previous games and then even learn the new characters like uh, what King K from Donkey Kong Inkling that looks pretty good and then also uh, from Metroid Prime Riddler or Rid I said Riddler thinking about Batman Ridley from Metroid Prime so on all those different characters, uh, see who's unlockable, see who's uh, unlocked right at the start, and then just go from there. So that'll be my plan. And then at a later date, as I get used to the controls, once I get the adapter and stuff like that, maybe I'll eventually try to play online and uh, go from there. So thanks for watching. I'm so excited for this. And uh, I'm curious if some of you guys are going to be getting the game. And man, maybe so I can play against some of you guys out there that want to get the game. Maybe for the holidays. And then maybe at a later date. And I can just probably do some team battles, hang out, and just have fun online. So that will be some other additional content for the game that I can do. Instead of just playing by myself, single player campaign, and whatever else they might have. Hopefully they have the event mode. I love the event mode. The classic mode. All-star just all those memorable game modes and even some of the new ones that they did. But that's it for the unboxing. I'm about to jump right in, post this up, and get ready to get my smash on <laughs> for Super Smash Bros. Ultimate.